Hello, stalkers. E. He steals and steals. Um, I'm back. The crying and screaming and torture, I guess, has subsided upstairs after Dad came home for lunch. So, we're going to try to do this remodel video, finally, right? Unfortunately, I don't have a dollar amount um, to say. I think after I do the video, I'll go through and count. So, when I post this video, I will have a retail value and then what I actually paid. Um, this is from last Sunday, and I went to... Okay, so I'm going to say six stores, but usually I'm off because Ashley keeps track better than I do. So maybe I went to seven or eight, but I think it was more like six because I hit good at the, I mean, I hit great at the first one. That was all the craft stuff, right? Artsy stuff. So, you know, maybe it was more like four or six. Okay. Doesn't matter. This, I want to show you everything I got. I feel like this is the biggest variety um, I've gotten on a Sunday so that I can give you a lot of UPCs. And the UPCs are important because these are items that may go in a remodel. You add these items to your list on your DG app. You enter the barcodes. Um, and then you have a list of items that's the items that you watch to see if they go half price and then you know there's a remodel coming okay um, if you need more in-depth information then I have a number of videos just go to my YouTube page and search remodel um, watch any of them that say remodel basics remodel UPCs and visuals remodel I mean remodel hauls I have a lot, but I think this one's probably going to give you the biggest variety to get a list going if you don't already have one. So, um, yeah, I'm going to go ahead and flip you. Okay. Yeah, I, okay, so I didn't actually get everything, and usually I have rugs down on my basement floor, but we had a water incident, you know, because it rained for like 10 days straight or something last week, or it was the week. Anyways, it's not the point. My floor is not the point here. So I still haven't unbagged everything just because, um, well, this, I thought, okay, this new shelf here I got, I can use for, you know, my remodel videos and pictures. And, um, Okay, it's just a lot, and so there was just no way. So we're just going to wing it and go through some stuff, okay? Um, let's start with craft stuff, because I know a number of people have asked about the craft stuff. Um, I also want to tell you, anything you see in these videos, you can go to your local store and just scan them in store and add them to your list that way. If you don't want to sit there and type in the numbers, okay? So um, any of this, if your store hasn't remodeled, um, if it's in store, then you can just scan, go through and scan, and that's going to be quicker. But I, of course, want to provide the UPCs and visuals so that if you need to do it this way, okay? Let's start with, we'll start with the quilt because um, a lot of the quilts, they used to go and now they don't. Um, but this one is still going. Unfortunately, I can't show you what it looks like in the package because somebody had taken it out of the package. Cheaters. But you can't, you can't fool me. So I saw it. I knew that one's a penny. So sure enough, even if you find it and it doesn't have a package, like most items in a Dollar General, there's usually another tag that has a UPC. Okay, so look somewhere else on the item if there's no tag on it with the UPC. Now, I have like 10 lights in this basement now, but I haven't tried to record over here to show UPCs. And clearly this, okay, let's see here. We're going to turn off this light down here. Don't fall, because I feel like it's blinding me and causing a glare and unnecessary I can't find that okay let's try it this way 
All right. Um, where'd you go? There you are. Is that better? Oh, I tell you what. The basement and lighting. Yep. So I need to figure out how to get lights on this side. Because I had it all lit up on the other side. And now I'm doing videos on this side. Excellent. 735-732-561948. I'll figure this out and probably carry stuff. Okay. So we've got... I have got to move some of these books out of the way because I can't even get to. Okay. The different art or artsy type stuff or whatever that go. We've got the dream catchers. Okay, good. That shows just fine. Excellent. We also have yarn animals. wild ones now i've seen you know stores that all of these sets go i've seen stores where only a couple of them go it's it all depends on the remodel and the store i'm still trying to move stuff to get back here because there's another one there's the friendship bracelet one You always want to make sure that you are not just checking the craft section for these, but that you're checking the toy section as well. I have found a number of these in the toy section. Okay. Next is the paint by numbers. There are two different paint by numbers that are in the craft section. There's the giraffe and there's the sunflower. Sometimes just one of these go, sometimes both. There's also one with a parrot on it. Sometimes it goes, sometimes it doesn't. I don't have a parrot one right now, but the giraffe and the sunflower. And you know what I might do? I'm probably gonna split these videos up because this is gonna be a really long video, right? Yeah, that's a whole bunch of UPCs to go through. Okay, going along with, we'll stick with arts and crafts. Um, the different foam things. There, um, there are a couple different vo v v versions. Um, I don't even know how to explain it, but you guys know about the foamy things. They are usually, they're under the fake flowers on a shelf and there are different ones there's the square ones there are circular ones and there are cylinder ones okay all those so far every remodel I've been to these have went um, but again who knows depends on your store depends on your area okay um, these UPCs, I don't know if they're going to show. They're tiny. They're really tiny. Mm-hmm. So, I will tell you, go to your store and just look under your fake flowers and scan the tags on the shelf, honestly, for the different foam things. Okay? Or, just if you're moseying along during a remodel, like I do, and you see them laying there, you know. Okay. Um, no, arts and crafts. So we've got all those. Um, a lot of them I did not pull out of the bag because it's a bunch of tiny stuff. I did not want to lose stuff. Okay. We've got these blank books. They are under. Um, they're on a shelf like next to the canvases and such. 
Can you see that? Okay, see. I'm gonna have to figure out a new plan. Always. Okay. I apologize for the technical difficulties. Mm. Okay. Six seven two one two five zero six eight eight seven eight. Again, you can go in your store and scan them as well. Also, from the art section, um, the eight by ten canvases go, but I've already given two of those to a friend because I only got two of them. So um, I do not have the UPC, but I would go ahead and just scan your eight by tens. These are more blank books. Okay, what else we got in here? All right, we have pony beads, translucent pony beads. I was going to say, we better be able to see this one because these are big. All right, then we have round doll pins. Kind of sounds like dolphins, huh? Sorry. Okay, let's see if we can get... Maybe I should turn that other lamp back on. I don't know. I'm also still dealing with a newer phone that I've got to get used to and the camera. Well, it was supposed to be better, but really the only thing that's better about it is it makes me look super bright doesn't zoom on my UPCs. 672-125-068-908. Next up, foam stickers. These are letters, alphabet ones. I'm going to find the sweet spot, I swear. Oh, that's a good one. Kind of. Okay. We have different, um, the different clays. Now, um, the white, it's a, it was a bigger block of just white. It didn't go. I would still go ahead and scan it. Maybe it goes in some. But the neutrals, the fluorescents, and then the primary, Oh, I guess it says up here, neutrals, brights, and classic. Okay, these will go typically. These UPCs are huge. Come on, phone. Give me a break. Okay. That's the neutrals. Then we've got the fluorescents. No. We don't, do we? Because there we go. And then we have the classic. All right. We also have the dazzling gems. This one is ginormous. So, okay, this is more clay, more pens, and okay, we've got some of these. The two-pack, whoops, wooden kit, it's a, is it a cat and a unicorn maybe? No, cat and a dog it looks like, okay. I think these are only a dollar normal price. So I think they'll show up 50 cents if your store is remodeling. We also have some of the letter stickers. same that's all the same um the craft lace 
which by the way, I still missed stuff in that craft section. Um, probably because I was so excited and I just, and I was doing a video and I wasn't paying attention. But of course, Marta, you knew to go check it again because you knew I'm squirrely. Sure enough, Marta found more stuff. Um, the feathers typically go, Marta got them. Um, there were feathers and something else. More of that lace that I just showed you. And yeah, so um, a lot of it in the art section goes. The gem sheets or gem strips. And there's colored, but there's also sparkling gem strips and that are just whatever, clear, not colored. Okay, do I have any other arts and crafts? I don't believe so. This, I messed up. It was not a penny. So, um, there was one that is, I think it must have been a smaller one that was already gone, and I couldn't get this to scan, so I just scanned the shelf tag, and yeah, it was the wrong thing. So, don't get that. It's $3.75. Okay. I think that's it on the arts and crafts, um, but I will throw in, there are new items that I did not know about. So I want to tell you about these. Um, and I want to thank the lady in the remodel that got these in her cart. So then I knew. Um, the Acne Control Cleanser. And these are on the regular shelves. Okay, just like everything else for the most part. It's the DG brand stuff. So the Acne Control Cleanser. Excuse me. And then there's the skin cleanser. And this is the studio selection. Oh, I'm sorry. Same with the acne control. There are, I got two different ones for a penny. The DG and the studio selections. Okay. This one, I found it was the studio selections. Come on. There we go. Okay. Also, the Hydrating Facial Mist Studio Selections. Oh, I hear the 14 year old stomping his grouchy way here. I'm making a video. I'm almost done. Yeah, honey, I have a lot to go through. Can't get that to show with that clear background. 077-443-901362. Is that right? Yes. Okay. And then also the facial cleansing buffs. Same thing. I found Studio Selection, but also DG Body. Um whoopsie and these were all um, in the same area let's get and I can't say that these haven't been posted because you know I check the Facebook groups and stuff here and there you know obviously used to in the beginning um, you know that's how you learn but now, I'm trying to do, <clears throat> well, all of this. <laughs> I don't really have a lot of time to check that stuff. So I don't know if that stuff's already been put out there. I don't know if there's more. Um, I did scan a variety once I knew those were. And I didn't find anything else. But that doesn't mean there isn't. So, um, you know, keep an eye on that section if you've got a remodel coming up. Um, yeah, so... Anywho, that's it for the art stuff and the new, as far as I know, new like health and beauty that's going in remodels. And I will get back with 
we'll do socks and underwear and sheets, lamps. We should be good with that and a couple of as seen on TVs. Okay, I'll talk to you guys soon. See ya.